There's some concern, however, among CCISD parents about that bond proposal. It's not about the price tag, but what's not included. Taylor Alanis is looking into that part of the story for us tonight. Taylor, you spoke with some parents who feel the district has forgotten them. Yeah, Pat, tonight some families are calling out the district, specifically those from the west side, saying CCISD's newest bond proposal is not investing in better campuses or equipment for kids in low income areas. My nieces go to Moody High School and that's right here on the west side and you know, they're, they're not getting new equipment. They're not getting new, you know what I mean? They're working with the same thing that they got at, they had last year and the year before that. Benny Garcia says new gyms for Atkins and Driscoll Middle Schools proposed in CCISD's 2022 bond package are unnecessary and unfair. The fancier schools, even though they're brand new, they're getting new equipment, they're, you know, and a lot of people are forgetting where they came from. Families in lower income areas say it sends a message to their children. I think that kids look for those type of things to be appreciated. And I feel like a lot of the West Side kids are not appreciated. Why is it that the South Side always gets uh, taken care of first? Those families say even though all the schools are within the same district, they aren't treated the same. All the kids should be treated right so they can all be uh, say, well, my school looks good too and I'm happy to be here or I don't want to be here because the South Side has better things. Some of your concerns to CCISD Superintendent Roland Hernandez. When we're putting our packages together, we're really trying to focus on where the greatest needs are, but at the same time paying close attention to that it's not just all attention given to one part of the city. But some West Side residents say lower income areas have old campuses, window AC units and aging portables. Families say their kids deserve better. Better units, you know, air conditions, but sometimes they're, it gets very hot and people do forget where they come from once they get over there. Hernandez said a lot has been addressed over time in every bond package. When you stop and think of the schools on all sides of town, including the west side, you'll see that many of those schools are new facilities. He says those new schools include Zavala, Oak Park, Shaw, Garcia, Cunningham, and South Park. As far as the reason why Adkins and Driscoll gyms were chosen, Hernandez says the prototype they chose originally didn't have enough space and all new middle schools will have two gyms moving forward. Pat. Taylor.